Hello, this short video is going to demonstrate how to add water quality data to the Nerds INA app. So I've already reviewed the instructions and I'm pretty familiar with how to use the app itself. And now I'm going to fetch data off the server so that I can go out and do my work. So you always want to fetch data before you go out into the field and this will bring any updated data to the device so that you can take it offline. So I'm going to go to this menu and I'm going to click fetch from web app and it's going to give me an option of, of basically all the features I have access to but in this case I'm only going to click on water quality features and water quality works and that will uh, fetch the data for all my water quality. And so there's a few different ways to enter data. One I can click on a, a site and click check or click data and that would show me all the past data for that site. I can also search for a site through this little magnifying glass and that'll take me to my site. If I click and hold on the magnifying glass that gives me the option to select water quality feature where I can then either click on a site to, end, to add samples or click on the blue arrow and it'll take me to the site. So I'm going to um, click on one of my sites and I'm going to enter some water quality data. So I'm going to go to the Lower Paia Park and click on the water quality site and click check. And since I already have a, a check for today, it's going to remind me of that and ask me if I want to resume the current check or enter a new check. So maybe I'll just go and click on a site that I haven't entered anything. So I'm going to click on the, the Kuao um, data set and I can click data and review data or I can click check and that'll open up my form, select my sampler, fill in my information. I can fill in all the numbers. I can add a note. And I can also add photos and take a picture. I can add work hours if I wanted to log um, a group or something like that. And then I save it. Now, I'm online, so when I view my data on here, my new data, it's black. If I were to switch to offline mode, any data I collect would be red. So I'm going to collect a new sample site at my current location. So I'm going to press this button on the left and this will take me to my current location. I'm going to zoom way in and now I'm going to press the point button and I'm going to add a new water quality feature. I'm going to save the feature and I can you know, give it a sample number. I can give the site a new name. And I can add samples. So I'm going to add the samples, fill out the form the same way. And click done. And now you'll see that my sample is red. And also, there's an indicator of two records that need to be synced. And when I go to my data menu, I can also see that I have a red water quality feature sample and a red sample that's on my list. So now I'm going to go to um, turn my app back online and I'm going to push the data to the server. And so now the data is synced to the server. So that's an overview of how to add water quality data on the Nerds INA app. Please let me know if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.